make you wish to feel in the dressing room after a win like that? Oh, brilliant, the lads are, are buzzing obviously and I think uh, it was a great performance and it was thoroughly deserved. I think the tactics and were spot on tonight and we're, we're delighted, yeah. What was your thoughts going into this game? A lot of the press, a lot of the bookmakers were having Rangers as the, the favourites. Well, for us, we're the team, we're the division ahead of them, aren't we? I don't know where that's came from, from my personal opinion. Albeit they've, they've started well and <coughs> they're winning games, but they've not really been tested. And Tonight proved that was our first real test and I thought we, we totally controlled most of it until obviously we go three up and then you expect a little bit of onslaught, but we well did it well and I think all in all it was a great performance. Simon, a 3-1 win over Rangers, you must be delighted. Yeah, I think that goes without saying. Um, to come here and get a result like that um, is, is very pleasing um, and we're delighted to win the next round of the Cup. What was your expectations coming into this game? To win, um, regardless of um, Rangers' status, they're obviously in the Championship at the minute. It's a massive club, um, filled with good players, but we know we're capable of coming here and getting a result. Um, it was a case of sticking to a, a plan of um, frustrating them at times. We knew we were going to be camped in at times and it was if we could weather the storm and, and see things out and, and take our chances when they came. Um, and we did that. The goals came at good times as well and it gives us something to hold on to for a wee bit. But um, we're more than just that, but um, ultimately we're absolutely delighted to win the next round of the cup. Murray Davidson scored and you almost set up Stephen McLean as well at the back, the back post for a second one. I was unlucky. I think we were, we were flying it at that point. We were creating chances. And we were taking confidence and to come in two 0 up at half time and we knew it. and the third the third one I think that killed it and took the wind out of their sails, didn't it? And delighted, yeah. What was that feeling like to, to score that third goal? Oh, it was brilliant, so obviously it gives us a little cushion and <coughs> we're a wee bit comfortable after that. So, so it was great and it was it was a great feeling to score it in front of our fans obviously in the corner as well. So delighted. Murray Davidson scored the, the opener, but yourself, you got the second goal. Was that off, off the training ground? Uh, yeah, Murray, Murray's goal was brilliant as well, as was Michael's. And um, we worked on mine yesterday, a bit in training, and it didn't go as well as it did tonight <laughs> yesterday, right enough. But um, no, it, was, it was great to see it fly into the net. Um, and like I said, we're absolutely delighted to win the next round of the cup. It was a great team performance from, from front to back. Stephen McLean must have covered about 20 kilometres tonight. He just works his socks off for the team. And that just spreads throughout the side. And the boys that came on as well, it was a, a massive collective performance from everybody. It was great going in 2 0 at half time, then Mikey scoring straight after half time. Yeah, I think that <laughs> when you come out at half time, you know Rangers are going to have a reaction. But that kind of took the wind out of their sails a wee bit. Um, and from then on in, it was a, if we could see the game out and, and a professional performance. Um, we got the goal, um, which is disappointing, but we didn't go under or anything. We, we just stuck to what we were doing and, and I think we deservedly get through the round. Were you wary of Rangers coming to this, given their, their form um, and this season, albeit in the Championship? <coughs> well, like I said before, we know how big a club Rangers is. Um, to come here, regardless of what division they were, they were in, um, and to come away with a victory is a, is a, is a great day. Um, but like I said, we can just concentrate on St Johnson. Um, it's about us and what we do. Uh, and then we know if um, we turn up and perform the way we can, we'll give ourselves a good chance at getting results. Uh, what's your thoughts going into the next round, the, the quarterfinals? Uh, well, it's back to league business on Saturday, um, and we'll see what the, the, the draw gives uh, and what we'll do with that at the time. But it's back to league business on Saturday. What's the feelings now going into the, the next round, the, the quarterfinals of the, the Scottish League Cup? Well, that, that was what we came here to do. To, the aim was to, to get in the next round, and we've done that now. And <coughs> we'll just wait and see who, who the other team's got on and, and who we get. And, but there's a, there's a few games before that, and it's back to league business against Dundee United on Saturday. What's your, what's your thoughts going into Saturday? Yeah, well, obviously we take confidence from from today. So, Dundee United, that I'm sure they'll they'll put up, they'll put, provide a good test for us. We're at home. We want to bounce back in the league from last from Saturday there. So, so we we'll take confidence for tonight, and hopefully we can go and get three points for the team on Saturday. Uh, a great team performance tonight. But how impressed have you been by Michael Halloran's form this season? He's been outstanding. Um, I think you saw last season as well um, what he's capable of. And somebody was just asking me there, how far can Michael go? And he's got everything going. He's got all the attributes and, and how far he wants to go in the game is entirely up to him. Um, he's a handful for whoever he comes up against because of his pace, but he's more than just that. Um, and like I say, he's, he's been in great form, so long may that continue for him and for the team. And just a word for the fans that came to Ibrox tonight. Brilliant, absolutely fantastic. And I'm just glad to send them back up to Perth with... Uh, with that victory and it'll make that journey back up the road a bit easier for them. So, but they were great and they were, 
were vocal and you, you could hear them sometimes out singing the Rangers fans, however many there was at them, so that was absolutely fantastic. Um, but we're absolutely delighted in the dressing room as well, but it's, it's back to league business now and heads on for that. Cheers to me, brother.